I'm Franklin, and this is a look at the month of May for Aquarius. Your best days in May will be the 11th, 12th, and 13th. This is when the moon will be in Aquarius, and this is when you will be at high tide. When the moon sign, or your ruling planets, Saturn or Uranus, pass through Aquarius, we all experience the Aquarius trait of dreaming what is going to be the future. And the uh, full moon lunar eclipse is coming up on May the 5th. And this will take place in the water sign Scorpio. So when it mixes with air sign Aquarius, it's sure to stir up a storm of emotions. Now here's a look at May for the air sign Aquarius and we'll begin with Aquarius in love. In the uh, first week of this month, an offer of love, one that you've turned down more than once in the past, is now flirting with you again. And again, it's time for a reality check to see what's really important to you. In week number two, all happenings in the material world are numbered and they come into being in a very orderly procession where one thing follows another. This timing is unknown until you know the expiration date of what comes before it. Now in week number three, the universe encompasses both the seen and the unseen worlds and it uses souls like yourself to be the passageway between those worlds. This is why so many good things fall into your hands. In week number four, when you meet another soul on the mountain, the first thing you figure out is, are they going up or down? Because their ascending or descending means that when you hitch on to them, you're going to go in the direction that they are going. Now, here's a look at May in your career. In the first week of the month, a new career is offered, but this would mean that you would take away someone else's job and you don't need that kind of a guilt trip. In week number two, the universe gives you what you need to grow instead of treating you to what you really desire. In week number three, to create anything good, all you have to do is ask that it be given to someone else. To create anything bad, all you have to do is take what someone else has. Now, in week number four, a good business partner is tame when you are wild and wild when you are too timid. Working together, cooperating with one who is your opposite brings success. Now, here's a look at May in your finances. In the first week of the month, someone is refusing to take no for an answer. And you're going to have to discover what you've got to do to make this person not be so persistent. In week number two, the only thing that you can do in this material world that will favorably impress the spirit world is to recognize your own imperfections and take ownership of them and change. In week number three, whatever you freely give, money or advice, is going to come full circle. Find a way to return to where it began. In week number four, the one that you're considering as a partner comes with baggage from the past, and this is going to have to be dealt with before any long-term commitments can be made in this. So that's a look at today's in May, according to your sun sign. And now, here's a look at the nights in May, according to the moon sign. In week number one, and this is the week of the full moon lunar eclipse, this moon rising in Scorpio. So the dreams and the visions that come now are about your transformation as the old dies away to make room for the new. In week number two, the week of the last quarter moon, which will rise in Aquarius, which rebels against the establishment. So the dreams and visions that come now 
will herald the coming big changes in your life. And then week number three, the week of the new moon, which rises in Taurus. So the dreams and visions that come now will show the rewards that come from having patience and knowing that tomorrow can be a brighter day. And then in week number four, the week of the first quarter moon, which will rise in Virgo, the dreams and the visions that come now concern the Virgo quest for perfection that slows things down as you wait for the perfect time to do anything. And that's a look at the month of May for the air sign Aquarius. If you like what you see here, please hit the subscribe button. Thank you.